Let's eat some Lego. Hello, everybody. I'm Kyle Kid, and today we're uh, looking at some delicious Lego treats. Now, don't actually eat the Lego treats, but you can stare at them and go, that's insane, and that looks delicious. This channel is called Bebop, and uh, they make some very, very cool Lego stop motion animations that feature different kinds of foods made out of Lego. This guy is, is he's on his lunch break and he's gonna he's gonna cook up some some delicious Lego. Um, I, I think that was flour. Everything here is is in Korean. Uh, I don't speak Korean, but uh, but I think we can figure it out based on context and stuff. Um, he, I guess he's like that he maybe he baked it. Oh my gosh, that is quite the tool for removing the outer edge of some kind of baked good. Is, is it bread? Did he just make bread? Because he had flour, he poured it into a pan, and then it turned into a brick. And now he punched the center. Oh no, he's making a donut! No, or a bagel? Bagel? Or a donut? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Now it has a hole, so it's it's delicious. Everybody knows that any kind of pastry that has a hole in the middle of it is going to be good. <laughs> He's deep frying it. it. It could, well, no, you, you boil bagels. I know, that's kind of weird, right? But you do. You boil bagels, and then you bake them. Uh, but donuts, you fry. You fry donuts. So, yes, that is a donut. It, it, now it's round. And he's giving it the, the, the little, uh, you know, a, a little bit of frosting. You gotta get those sprinkles. That was that was cool. That was like a magic trick. Coca Cola and the donut, the breakfast of champions. Well, no, this is his lunch. Cause he's. <laughs> I love it. Ow. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is so good. Drink up. He's good. Don't eat the Lego. Thank you for the reminder. All right, how about a Lego hamburger? Let's uh let's see how this plays out. This should be cool. All right. Into the kitchen we go. We got a mess, just a mess everywhere. What well, I don't even is that supposed to be like the burger? You got to clean it up. I know, I'm sorry. As someone with with young children, I I know the pain of having to clean up Lego. It is it is very annoying. But you know what's worse than cleaning up Lego? Stepping on Lego. Ugh. Nightmare. Okay. What are we turning this into? A shoe. Uh, an Air Jordan. Did you really just take a bite out of that shoe? We're, we're turning the sole of the shoe into a meal? With a little bit of mustard. I love the way that, that, like, they make it look like it's sizzling in the pan. I don't know how edible that is, but <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's cooking. So that's, that's good. Okay, we got, we got more flour. What are we doing with the flour? You're just, like, molding it? That looks gross. What is that? Oh, that, that was cool. Oh, he's making the bun. Okay. You got some butter. Just, oh, it's so good. Okay, spread spread the butter. Butter on, on a burger bun. I guess, well, maybe if you want to, like, toast it. But, I mean, let's be honest. Like, who cares what it really, what ingredients it's using? We already kind of fell off a little bit with the ingredients part when we started using the bottom of a shoe to make a burger. Oh, that's so good. Those little tomato slices. Oh, I love it. That's, I mean, that's a good looking burger, even though I know that it is made out of a shoe. I still might try it. How is that? He, he seems to like it. Also, I love the the magic that is pouring a Coca-Cola and it just becomes a cup of Coca-Cola. I need that. All right, what do you got for me, Lego chef? We got a, a refrigerator full of different ingredients. I love the way that those fruit look. 
as Lego. They look so cool. I don't even know what kind of fruit that is. It's an orange fruit. But it has a, a black outside. I don't even... I don't even know. Maybe... I don't know. Maybe a peach? No, it doesn't seem like a peach. I don't know. Whatever. That was cool. I don't even know what that ingredient is. But that was cool what he did with it. What are you doing? Your light... Oh, it, it's wood. He's just lighting a fire on his kitchen island. Okay. All right, we got the oil. It is it is uh, popping off. Ooh, fried shrimp. Or, or n not fried shrimp, but the batter. Like tempura, I guess, is what that is. Dip it in there. Ooh, fried chicken. Oh, I like that. Tempura fried chicken. That's, that's good stuff. I love that it just disappears. You know? Oh, it's so cool. Little mustard on the side. It swishes around in the bowl. That was cool. Pour yourself a cold one. Uh, they've got the cotton balls on the top to, for the foam. That's awesome. What kind of vegetable is that? Also, there was a rock inside that thing. I don't know if you should be eating that, man. Whatever. You're eating plastic Lego pieces. That <laughs> that looks really good. I'm not going to lie. Holy cow. Oh, I'm, I'm really genuinely getting hungry. We're making a sandwich. Oh, And I got to be real with you guys. Sandwiches are my favorite lunch. Like, hands down. You offer me a sandwich for lunch, I'm taking it. it it's it's like l lunch is my favorite meal of the day. And the reason it's my favorite meal of the day is because sandwiches exist. And this is quite the sandwich. Holy cow. I didn't even realize until this very moment that we're not just making any sandwich. We're making the world's biggest sandwich. That is a lot of butter. I normally don't put butter on like a, a a deli sandwich, like a lunch sandwich, but I respect it. And I love that he's just got giant uh, lettuce leaves growing in his garden. This is incredible. Whoa. That was very cool. Ah! Oh, you kind of turned it into tomato sauce. Are those olives, maybe? I don't even know what those are. Okay. I'm sure they're they're delicious. Whatever they are, I'm sure they're delicious. This must be the meat. Maybe some kind of roast beef or, or ham? I'm going to go with roast beef. Because it's, it's brown. Oh, the, the other side of the sandwich, of course. It's sleeping. You're... you're it's, it's time. It's time. It's time, giant sandwich bun. Your time has come. This is what you lived for up to this moment. This is it. <laughs> I don't know if I like the idea of my sandwich bread swimming through a pool, but that looks amazing. And let's just let's just stop for a moment here and appreciate like the food is not real but the lego is real this guy had to really build a lego sandwich that is this big Th that's a lot of lego i can't even imagine how many pieces are in this entire thing but just the bread alone must be thousands of pieces that's crazy chocolate cake all right Lego chocolate cake. Let's make it happen. Is that milk? I would I would I would guess that that's milk perhaps or some kind of batter maybe. I don't know. I'll be real with you guys. I don't know how to make a chocolate cake. I I I don't know how to bake at all to to be honest. Like I'm I'm a terrible baker. Anytime I've tried to make something baked, it does not turn out good. Okay, so we have some kind of... I, I think that this is egg, butter, and milk. I think. He did just pick it up, though. 
It's a little weird. It's kind of gross, but it's also very awesome. <laughs> okay, a banana. Uh, what? Is that just water? Tell me that was just water. It had it had fish symbols on it, which I'm like, is that some kind of fish oil or something? But I don't think so. I think it was just water. He threw in a, a kiwi, an apple, and now a banana, which I'm all for it. Throw some fruit in your cake. I love it. But I thought this was a chocolate cake. I guess you can have fruit in a chocolate cake. I, I don't typically see that, but I'm not against it. Oh, oh, it's, oh it's bubbling. Oh, it's bubbling. Here's the chocolate. Break it up into little pieces, of course. You need to you need to melt it. Or are you just gonna pour it over the top of the cake? I don't know. I don't know. I've never made uh, I've never made a chocolate cake from scratch. I've certainly never made a chocolate cake out of Lego. That that looks amazing. I, I gotta be real. Like Oh. Whoa. That's like actual frosting. <laughs> Which makes it much more tempting to actually eat it. He, he took a bite out of it. Pizza. Okay, so we've got multiple ones in this. Oh, I'm so excited about the pizza. Pizza is a top tier food. There's just, there's no way around it. Like, who doesn't like pizza? Seriously. I'm sure there's some people out there who don't like pizza, but let's be real. Pizza is incredible, and if you don't like it, you might be an alien. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I have to inform you of this. That's a good-looking pizza dough right there. I have made homemade pizza before, and uh, it turned out pretty good. Pretty good. But I have a friend who who makes, like, his his own dough and everything, and uh, it's, it's, it's amazing. It's honestly incredible. We got some pepperoni. Okay. I'm liking it. Some onion. I'm okay with onion on a pizza. Onion is like... I, I feel like onion can can be a little overpowering sometimes. You know, it kind of like takes over the show. I, like, I don't like onion on a, a burger. I don't like raw onion on a burger because I feel like it's the only thing I taste. And it also gives you really bad breath. But as I mean, that's, that's a small price to pay. I just feel like it, it takes over. What is this? Some kind of seasoning? No, it's cheese. What am I talking about? You put the cheese on top of the toppings? That's not standard practice, I don't think. I'm okay with it, but it's just, it's a little unconventional. I love the way that pizza looks, though. Oh, here we go, the slicing. Okay. Oh, the way that it droops like that, that's so good. Add some peppers. Oh my gosh, that is incredible. Oh my goodness, that looks so good. That, that I just love the way that the pizza slice like, like drooped like that. Ugh, it's fantastic. All right, you got your Lego phone charger. We're making sushi, I guess. So you got to start with the rice. Sushi rice. Which I, I think is... um. Is just white rice with, I think they add like vinegar and, and sugar. Because it's sticky. I think that's how you make it. I've never made it before. I'm just, I'm just guessing at this point. What are we doing with the egg? What's the egg for? I guess we're about to find out. Stir it up. Throw it in a pan. Oh, oh, you're making like a... a the sushi is gonna have egg in it, maybe. I forget what they call that. Is it tamago? I think maybe. I I don't know. But but there is egg sushi, but it's just egg and rice, right? Is that what you're about to make? That's some fantastic looking rice. The way it kind of like bounced in the bowl. Oh man! And you got your your seaweed, your nori. Yep. Yep. 
wrap it around it. There you go. Okay. Egg sushi. What's that? Oh, wasabi. Oh! <laughs> uh. Oh, here we go. The fish. Fillet the fish. Oh, no. Oh, he's gone. We've turned him into Lego. Okay. Clean off the, the scales. Add a little wasabi, a little rice. Wrap that, buddy. Oh, no, don't wrap it. Just leave it like that. There you go. What kind of fish is that? Kind of looks like a salmon, but the fish... <laughs> fish head. That's just cruel. That make the fish head look at what it used to be. <laughs> he, had a, he had a good life. What is this? Did it say sandwich? Are we making another sandwich? I'm okay with that. A different kind of sandwich this time around. We got some kind of like, uh, uh, I, I don't know. I actually have no idea. There's just a bunch of jars. He just, he just poured bread out of that jar. I want bread in a jar. Now what are we doing? We're cooking something? Okay, take some butter. Cook that bad boy up. I love it. Crack an egg. Beautiful. Watch this egg. Oh, it's so cool. It's so cool. I love the way that they do that. Why does that bread have gray crust? I don't know if you should be eating that. That's, that's definitely not normal. Besides the fact that it's made out of plastic. Let's ignore that for now. <laughs> what is this? Oh, is this peanut butter and jelly? Are we making peanut, like a fancy peanut butter and jelly? No. No, why are we, why are we blending up something that is green? We're blending up broccoli? Lettuce? Just making little tiny lettuce leaves? Okay, this is not peanut butter and jelly. Oh, it's an egg sandwich. It's some kind of egg sandwich. I don't know what the red part is. Maybe it's like a pepper sauce. Yeah. Some salsa. Oh, no. Oh, there's heads. There's Lego heads in your... <laughs> the squish and the splatter. Oh, I mean, that's a good looking sandwich, though. And remember, as always, don't eat the Lego. I, it's tempting. It is tempting. Don't do it.